Hi, my name is Erin from Juniper and Oaks. I'm a crochet pattern designer. And recently I got together with other pattern designer friends of mine and we started talking. We came up with a list of things that we wanted you guys to know. I think that the third one's really gonna surprise you. And you know, stick with me to the end and I'll share you my thoughts as well. So do you wanna know what crochet designers really want you, the crocheter, to know? Let's find out. I want you guys to know that I love your pictures. Keep them coming. Keep sending me pictures of your finished work. When I get to see what you guys did with my patterns, it makes me so happy. Like all your color choices and where you're gonna put them and who you're giving them to. Wanna share your pictures on social media, Instagram, Facebook, anywhere you usually share them. And send me emails, put them in your Etsy reviews. I get to see them when you do that too. Put them in your Ravelry projects. Anywhere that you can post them, that's the best. I want to keep seeing it. Keep it coming. Oh my goodness. I love opening up my inbox and seeing replies to my newsletter. People saying, oh gosh, I love that design. Or that was a really helpful hint. Just interacting with me because it's so isolating to be in this business. To have people just talk to you like you're a person is so fun. I know sometimes it can feel, because you don't know me in person, really odd to email me back and be personal. But that's actually a really cool thing. One of the most contentious issues that I come across is ads on websites. We all hate them. Trust me, we hate them. We wish we didn't have to do them. But by the same token, they're the very reason that we can afford to do free content for you guys. So we can put patterns free on the blog. And despite what people might think, we don't get paid a ton of money for them. So yes, we all know that they're a pain in the butt, but unfortunately, we can't keep doing what we're doing without being able to feed our families. My biggest thing that I would say to everyone is be kind, love each other. My people are generally really friendly and they love the fact that we share free things. But sometimes, you know, if something doesn't go quite the way we think it should or a pattern's not quite working out, give the designer some grace, reach out. We love hearing from you guys. If you loved making it, if you, you know, didn't have any issues with it, if it worked out just the way you thought it would, uh, if you love the colors, let us know because we love hearing that. That feedback means so much to us. And again, be kind. As a designer, like designing is our business. And without crocheters who are willing to support us and let us know what they like, we couldn't do what we, what we do. And so we just so appreciate their support and their kindness. And when they buy our patterns, we love it. And we just so appreciate that you allow us to do what we do. We love it when you share our patterns with your friends. Share my post, share the Ravelry listing. It gets us a little jolt of excitement every time that we see someone sharing our stuff. It's like, oh my gosh, that's great. Someone likes the thing that I created. Even if they don't make it, they shared it in front of the world. One thing that's really hard for us to do is market our stuff. <laughs> when our content, when our designs and patterns are seen out there in front of the world, it gets people interested in our designs. So go ahead, if you don't have time, if you don't have the money for the yarn, if you don't have whatever, just still go ahead and share the post. It's free for you and it's just invaluable for us. Another thing that I love as a designer, especially like in my small little Facebook group, is when my people help each other out. So if you have crocheted up one of my patterns and somebody in my Facebook group has a question, I love it when you go ahead and answer that question. I love the community that I have built and that you guys have built around my crochet patterns and my events. We work kind of as a team. So when I see my community engage with each other, answer questions, give tips and tricks and color combination choices, I just love it because this is what it's about. You know, it's about community over competition. It's about just crocheting because the love of crochet. 
I love crochet and I love my community and I just really appreciate you guys as the crocheters, as the customer, as the people who are making my crochet patterns. Thank you so much. So tell me, did you recognize any of those other designers? Did any of our notes surprise you? Let me know in the comments below. Please go ahead and like this video so that other people can find it. And if you liked it, why not subscribe to my YouTube channel where I share all sorts of yarn related content. Make sure you hit that little bell so that you're notified anytime I come out with any other yarn related videos such as this one. Thank you for being part of my crochet community. Happy crafting.